Oh, he has someone really mad at him. Are you ready to be a loud boy? Are your friends gonna like it? Yeah, they will love it. So are all the girls when you pick them up on the first date and it's just wah, bah, bah. They're like, wow, oh, this car is so loud. I wish you had a truck. Why don't you pick me up in your mom's Bronco next I time? I don't know why about everything. Welcome to another video. Today, we have a Cobb access port. All right, open this bad boy up. What do we- Access port is finally here. So it's in here. Yes. Your first access port, one of many to come. Just the plug for it. Quick start guide. Calibrations for forward sticker. Yep, this is a carb compliant sticker for California reasons. Warning, installation of this access port over anything other than OEM or COP software may result in ECU slash TCU failure. We got the access port, so. Sheesh. Stickers, very important, we got two. This is the mount for it. Yeah, and then take a picture of that on your phone because I think you reference that later. And when a tuner needs it, they're gonna ask you for it. This thing in here? Yeah, the tuner is gonna ask you for that. Accessories. That's the daddy cord. That's the mount. The mount. Turn your key on. I press install. Mm -hmm. Sheet 187 on okay. tape. Yeah, do that one. Testing. Why is that? System ready. Don't press the start button, whatever you do. Download the file attached, so it saves it to downloads. So go to downloads and finder, and then go find the file and drag it to the access port window, and then hit yes. Cool, now it's on here. And all you gotta do is hit eject. And it's gonna pop your head. Change map successfully. Okay, actually, well, no, we'll finish the spark plug and then you'll be ready to rock. And you want to thread them all in by hand as much as possible. So, Alan asked you to turn on some things to monitor for him to be able to see on the access port and those only. So when you when you do a data log, you can record like a hundred things. He's like asking you to record like 15, it's on the email. And so you gotta go to... Go up to the top, configure data logging. So go look at the email and then so click one turns green and click it again it turns off so make sure that only the ones he asked you are selected okay. the next day now that I have all the things listed on here that Alan wants me to look for while doing the pool uh, and uh, everything he wants me to log is all set now we're gonna go to a pool between 2500 and 6000 rpm wide open throttle and we'll log it I think nobody's behind me waiting for me which is perfect I'll wait a little a second about 25, full throttle. Alright, all the way to 6K. I should have got it, so I'm gonna stop it now. Now that I did a data log pulling onto the freeway, I got the Cobb access port plugged into the computer, and we got the access port manager up here on the computer. Got the log right here, and then I'm gonna 
drag it over and send it to Alan at Edge Auto Sport so he can check it out. After six revisions, Alan sent us the final product of the tune and he hooked us up with the verbal tune. So I just installed that right now and we're gonna go test it out. What is a verbal tune? A verbal tune is like when you rev it and then like it'll like pop a little or like crackle after you like rev it or like downshift or let off the gas or whatever. That's basically what it is. It's definitely doing it. He has someone really mad at him. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. Oh no, 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 no. Bro, we, we got a Karen. We got a Karen. <laughs> She's yelling at me right now. Dude, she doesn't follow where we live. <laughs> she was flipping me off. Oh, really? I stopped and she's like, she's like, what the f you think you're doing? She's like, go do that somewhere else. I was like, sorry, ma'am, I'm just testing it out. What? Oh, you talked to her? <laughs> yeah, this lady on the side of the road was screaming at Parker, calling Four. him an a-hole. Four. For being loud. Yeah. How dumb is that? She said I was Stupid. ripping it too much. She was even flipping him off. Hey, he's a kook. It's been a few weeks. We made some changes. Alan got us all hooked up. This thing is burbling really good now. So I've just been driving it around, kind of testing it out. Sounds really good. It's really dirty right now, so we're gonna wash the car and then we're gonna go get some clips of uh, how it sounds. First things first, we're gonna start it up and see how she sounds. Alright, now we're gonna go drive it around and test her out. If you ever need any type of tuning or anything done to your Focus ST, Alan is the man at Edge Auto Sport. He hooked us up with the tune. Uh, it's running much better and faster, and not only did he get us the tune, but he has a burble tune, so it sounds sick too. And uh, he makes a process whole, the whole process nice and easy through email. You just send him data logs and he sends you maps back. And it's a super easy process, super uh, good customer service and easy to talk to. So highly recommend. And I'll leave the link in the description to Edge Auto Sports website. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. Alan did a really good job on this tune and the burble tune. So if you liked today's video, go check out this one. And we got more parts coming for this thing, so stay tuned. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.